It's Spacey Sims, and we are back with more of The Sims 4 Eclipsed, which is our Solar Lunar Zodiac Challenge. Thanks, Makoa? Because she, she, I guess it's because of her after-school activity. Um, Suki, can you... Oh, right. Um, oh my god, wait, did we... I mean, I knew we aged up the toddlers, but I think... <gasps> right, did we age up Leonis, too? Oh my god, we did. And I had to do Venus's room, right. Because Leonis's room was already fine, and then the toddlers have a room. Um, but I did uh, Venus's room. So, did we give her a makeover? No, she already had her makeover, and we just hadn't done her room. So, because she's supposed to get into, like, level 8 of any instrument or whatever. Um, this is her room down here. She's got all sorts of, like, posters and stuff. We mixed a little bit of her Henry Puffer posters, but some, like, more musical posters. She's got her desk down here. Um, just a little reading nook. Um, and then, you know, her little wardrobe thing over here. And then, like, just an area with, like, guitars. I mean, that one's a mirror. And then these ones are just fancy lights or whatever. And then, like, the keyboard and everything. Just so, you know, whatever. That wall you're never gonna see i wasn't originally gonna decorate it but then i'm like oh fuck we gotta put some musical instruments or something and so anyway that's her room so she's got her little room made over and actually one, two, wait one two three four five six seven okay we got eight sims in her house right um let's go modify and cast let's check them out we have got to get artemis in the house so i think we'll invite him over i did i think i gave him a makeover um in the house he's in now so then we'll bring him in. Uh, we won't be able to save the house. Okay, so Leonis's alien form is just whatever it is. Um, but here's our boy. Like, um, yeah, and you can see <laughs> the, the shirt and the pants don't quite fit, but I kind of like that. Like, you could see a little bit of stomach. Like, he would be like that. Um, he does have pointy ears, yeah. Um, he's so freaking beautiful. Like, holy goddamn shit. And did we... Oh, we did give him a couple extra outfits because he'll be around for a while. Because, you know, he was our artsy. He's going to be in the acting career. He's going to go... To, oh, but the acting career is kind of borked. It's okay. Um, The acting career... He has to get level 8 of the acting skill. So, like, for teenage-wise, we'll have him go do whatever. We'll... Maybe by the time he ages up to a young adult, they'll fucking fix it, but who knows. But the acting career is kind of fucked up right now, so... And with the amount of time that I would have to... Uh, that we'd never be able to do it. For the way I play, having to record so much for you guys... Or even still, even just if I only had one or two epi... Okay, no, his hair was like the pinky purple color. I just... It just threw me off because it didn't... He's fucking gorgeous. Look at him. Um, But yeah, so... And he, like, has his, mus his pretty desk to, like, play with his makeup and everything when he was a kid. So, you know. Um, and this one is a mini skirt Because, you know, he was a little... He wore some, like, gender... Well... He is just gender fluid, I guess, as a kid. Like, he didn't really care. He wore some clothes that would, would have been in the girls' section. Like, whatever. He didn't give a shit. So he doesn't give a shit now, either. So, um... But, yeah. He has a little bit of, like, I think, because he, he doesn't look exactly like Soleil. He does have more Soleil in him, I think. But he does have a little bit of Suki in him still. It's kind of interesting. Um, But yeah, his formal, I fucking, I'm sorry. I love that. I want that jacket separate. Somebody separate that jacket for me, because I want to pair that jacket with those fucking leather pants. And that would just be my dream come true. Um, His athletic wear. His sleep wear, because, like, you know. Like, his party wear. I fucking love those. That's a recolor I did. <laughs> um, oh, and of course, he's, well, like, you know, he's got, like, all the fancy, like, eye makeup and everything done and, like, that. He doesn't have that for, I don't think, and I think his formal wear is just normal. He just has eyeliner. His swimwear is just pretty normal. He definitely got Soleil's form because he's, like, got the wide chest and shoulders and everything. And Suki is just a little more, like, not like that. Um, so his hot weather outfit. We might actually have to give him our hot weather and cold weather outfits. Um, 
this cold weather outfit. Because actually, that's funny. Does cast... I mean, casters... They all have a few everyday outfits just because. But I don't remember if I gave them multiple... It's so funny. This is your nephew, who's a young adult. <laughs> kind of forgot about that. Yeah, he's got two cold weather outfits and two hot weather outfits. So I could actually give him more. Um, but then this is Scorpius. So... And he... Yeah, he's our vampire child. Actually, I think Artemis was also a vampire. I changed him to a spellcaster just because I want to... One of each would have been nice, you know. Um, so... Here's our little vampire child. So his everyday outfit, his formal wear. Not that we're ever going to see 90% of these. His sleepwear, his sleepwear and his everyday we'll see. And maybe his hot or cold, depending. Um, his party wear. His swimwear. We might see that if it was hot, but I don't know. His hot weather outfit. I don't remember what the... I think it's winter. And his cold weather outfit. It's cute. Shit. Okay. So that's them. Um... Leonis is just precious. So, I mean, I do... I'm pretty sure... Oh, how have I saved? Uh, I'm pretty sure I saved Artemis at least with our spellcaster family. So, with Sammy and Argus and Artemis. So, we'll just have to invite him... Argus and Ari. Artemis is the son. Oh, my God. Too many A names. We should not have named him Artemis. But that's just the names for the Scorpio. So, um... Yeah, so. So Castor and Persepi have done what they need to do. Uh, so now we're just moving on. But we're not gonna I'm not gonna like get rid of them right away or anything like that. Like she needs to spend some time with her daughter and teach her how to do mermaid things. But she's actually done what she need actually she hasn't, I don't think. No, she's only baking level seven, so she's not quite there. Um Venus has returned home with a project. Persephone has returned home with a project. Good lord. And Suki didn't pay the bills yet. I kind of forgot when I saw him walking. I was like, the hell? I just... Oh. He paid the bills, but he didn't get the mail. Alright. So you two. How are you doing? Okay, you can go to go eat. And then we'll put your projects out. Let's put your projects out. Oh. Whose projects were these? Oh, it doesn't tell you who made them. Oh, shit. That was Persepi. Okay, let's put this in your thing. Who made this one? Ah, fuck. It was obviously someone who's dead. Well, I'm just going to pretend it was yours and it's going in your room now. I don't remember if it was hers or if it was Caster's. It wouldn't have been Caster's because it would say his name on... Oh, and she has one. Huh. But, oh, and he's got one, too. Well, but I don't think it would have been Aries or Tejita's. All right, you know what? Let's just sell it, because we don't know who it is, and we'll just sell it, because I don't know who fucking did it. Okay, you can take that, and then who made this one? That's you, right? Yeah, okay, good. So we'll keep this. Um, so you can put this out. When you're done eating, how are you doing? Another solar system project. Can we get something else, maybe? Anyway. Uh, you are... When you're done eating... Who's calling you? Hold on. Sammy is wondering if I want to go to his house and hang out. <gasps> Actually, yes. And take... Um, well, don't take Leonis with you. Why can't I take... Why can't I take Castor with me? Anyway, where the hell's my bird? Oh, there he is. Hi! You're hiding, he can't see you. He's snuggling with his toy, but where he is sitting is, like, behind a candle, so I can't, like, my... Between me and him is a candle in my vision. <laughs> And I was like, he's not in his cage and he's being quiet, which usually means he's being trouble. Your birdie friends haven't come back, huh? There's little birdies that are, I think, making a nest. He didn't want Castor to come over, but... Kiss cheek. Offer gratitude. 
Why? I mean, you're grateful for him for giving you a beautiful daughter. Oh, that is. Woohoo! Um, all right, where's our baby? Where is he? Where's Artemis? Uh, it's probably upstairs. That was where he was the last time we left him. I heard him. I can hear him. Oh, there he's playing in the toilet. Okay, there's Dad. All right, so here he is. This is our little troublemaker. Turn around, you little brat. So here he is. Um, and unfortunately, yeah, no, actually, I think it's about, yeah, he's got the heterochromia. But yes, because Castor has black eyes, but it's brown because, like, they have to at least match somewhat. And the black one doesn't match, like, doesn't look right, you know what I mean? Um, but he doesn't have pointy ears. Anyway, let's, um, I don't think we can actually do anything. Actually, yes, we can. We can modify him and Cass because it's not he's not in our family. And then I'll add him to our family. I'll have her do it. We'll cheat him in. And then we'll send him home and it'll be easier. Hey, so, so there he is. There's our little adorableness. And actually, technically, yes, he does have because I couldn't get the the right eyes. He kept it kept changing because it won't save. I don't know why on my toddlers it won't let me put custom eyes on them. It reverts them. So when I had, so they actually are different. So I guess the black one would have matched, but uh, that one's just dark brown, but it's fine. But the ones that I wanted to put on him as base for the turquoise, they're custom content, obviously, because then heterochromia matches. But then it would change it, and then he'd come out, and he's like, well, now his eye is red. Well, no, it's supposed to be turquoise, because it's supposed to be the same color as um, Argus's eye, because that's his dad. So anyway, I don't know. So they look weird, but it's fine. Only while well, he's a toddler. Um... His formal wear, his sleep wear, he's a little skinny bean too. Um, his party wear, his swim wear, I was like, which one is this? His hot weather outfit, <laughs> so cute. And his cold weather outfit. So there's our little bean. Um, and I actually just want to make sure that I saved them. Probably going to have to log back on now. Um... I do want to make sure I save this household just because I'm not going to be able to save him. Yeah, so there he is. And this was with, yeah, Leonis. Okay. Because I'm not going to be able to save him for a little while. Um, You know what I mean? Because there's nine sims. There'll be nine sims in the house and you can only have eight. So, well, I can have ten, but I can't go into create him. I do wish they didn't. I mean, eight is technically... Too much to handle and 10 is too much. That's why I kill some of my Sims like early in this house. I'm like, I only got to get rid of people because I can't handle it. Oh, shit. He's out here. To oh, shit, 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 shit. Is she out here? Did she leave? Where'd she go? Fuck. Oh, man. I was hoping it didn't, wouldn't, isn't going to do this. But where'd she go? Is she still here? Okay. Modifying cast. Let's go into her and see if it'll switch me back to her, and then I can go back. Sorry, this is not fun, but at any rate, because I wouldn't have been able to. Well, I mean, I guess I could have. All right, yay! Hopefully, it'll have me play her and not the other house. Otherwise, we're gonna have to load again, and then we could have just done that, like picked the house, chosen her, and loaded this instead of loading into cast and then coming back into the game and then having to go back and then and then we would have just we just doubled our loading. Welcome to 15 minutes of gameplay, but at least it goes fast. Good. You're here. Where's this boo? Okay, so shift click and let's add him to our family. And now you can we send can you send him home? Can you more choices? I don't... I can't send him home. Actions. Huh. MC command center. Sim commands. Mm. 
cheat. Yeah, well, anyway. So anyway, he's here. Oh, there we go. Now I can send him home. Okay, let's send him home. There we go. He's magically home now. Oh, where'd she go? Oh, she's playing on the computer. You were supposed to... Anyway. Um, let's switch control. Let's go back home. She can hang out with Sammy. That's fine and dandy. You have a grand old time. You gotta get your baking skill up. Caster's already gotten his thing up. Unfortunately, Caster is gonna be the next one to vacate the family because he's the oldest. Um, and he's a vampire. Otherwise, he'll never age and die. So... This is what we do. <laughs> this is the worst. Because nobody really ages up. I kind of almost wish it was like, okay, well, we, oh, now they're married. You move out and, like, go live your happy life. But it's like, no, now you have to die. And not because Soleil really needs the life essence, because he doesn't. Um, we don't need it, but it's like we need to keep you out of the... Why do your calves look so fucking gigantic in those pants? Like, what the actual hell? That is awkward. Look at them, they're like, boing. Like, that is just fucking ridiculous looking. I do love the fact that his shirt's, like, bunched up, and you can, like, see some skin poking out. I mean, it doesn't... Like, there's some clipping and stuff, but, like, yeah, I just figure that's how you would be. You would 100% be that way. Look at you. Are you sad? Why are you sad? You were bullied. Oh, you know what? That's rude of people to bully you. Yibs. <laughs> they're gonna bully him because he's so fucking gorgeous. Like, look at him. Jesus Christ. Okay, so, like, Ares was my favorite. I was like, my god, Ares, why are you so fucking hot? And then Ares had Caster, and I was like, Jesus Christ! Okay, well, at least, I mean, I still think Ares was hotter than Caster, even though I love Caster, don't get me wrong. But, like, this motherfucker? Holy shit. Suki and Soleil make some beautiful fucking boys. Like, Jesus. I mean, Tejita was beautiful, too. But, like, look at him. He's like, fuck it, I just, you know what, you're my new favorite, so, sorry, Caster. <laughs> Ares had to die because he was getting old, it was like, all right, we let him, we let him stay till his old age, but, like, I feel like that's the way this series is going, is I'm like, um, so, like, I just need the room, and we got a new favorite, so time to move on. Um, Here's some pay, talking shucks. Ebony. Caster's like, that's rude. And it's like, yeah, no, it's going to have to be time for you to move on. We're going to have to sacrifice you soon. I'm just saying, because we can't keep, like, 30 sims in the house. Like, at some point, they're going to age up, and I'm going to need to save again. And so you're going to, you and Persepi are going to have to go. Like. And your story's gone. Like, we, you've had your children. That's what we wanted you to do. And now we're done with you. And bye. Bye, Felicia. I kind of feel bad because Soleil and Suki were kind of, I mean, there's almost no point to either one of them. Like, <laughs> but we can't get rid of them. <laughs> I don't think I'd want to. Um, you have 11 days till you age up. So who's the next one? We don't have anybody aging up. Eh, it's going to be her. Oh, uh, well, I would like to have her saved eventually. But I mean, when she becomes a teenager, young adult, adult, it doesn't really matter. She's going to look the same. Um... Okay, we'll wait. How is only one of you aging up? You have seven days. You have seven days. So, okay, can you put on your cold weather outfit then? Dresser. Change outfit. Dork. Um, but how come he's not in our calendar? He should be here, too. That's fucking weird. It's like the game doesn't register him as part of the house because maybe because there's nine sims in here, but... You're fine. You're gonna go watch... This, I mean, this is technically your... Not exactly twin brother, but... Ugh. Ari. Sexy motherfucker. I should have, like, put Morgan in as, like, an elder or something and just 
put him in there as their parent? I think I probably can. I can probably set relationship status like as a parent if I if they meet Morgan or they go. Probably do it, but. Where are you? Oh, and he's a charmer. And a. How did you get the great kisser trait? How the fuck did that even happen? When you got the savant trait. Oh, you probably inherited them from your parents. That might be part of the slice of life, Mon. I don't know. Part of something, I guess. You inherited it from your parents, I'm assuming. But... That's a little awkward for a toddler to have. Oh, you're hungry. I was like, you better not be touching your tummy because you're pregnant, boy. Like... So, we have our vampire and our spellcaster babies. We only have one spellcaster child. Can you go to bed? Are you incapable of walking up the stairs? God, tellers are annoying. Alright, hold on. Let's teleport you up here. Teleport. And then sleep. What about you? You're fine. Alright, um... Oh, shit, I was... Fuck. Oh, fucker. I was gonna have her do her project, but... Where are you? Why are you in her room? Stay out of here. It's not for you. Um, you were supposed to have eaten, so I'm just gonna... Is this your project? Let's start working on your project. I'm gonna cheat your need up a little because it's only 8 p.m. You are gonna come down here and start working on your project... What are you injured? Aw, sorry, kiddo. All right, and you, sex on with. Why is Ari still at our house? He did come over last time, didn't he? Yeah, he did come over because we were like, "Oh, look, introduce yourself to your son," and now you're just still here. Although, we could have literally just had Castor have children with one of them, and then Leonis could have taken the other brother. It's too late for that. I mean, we're going to have to find you a gorgeous man. Because let's be real. Oh, my sins are gay. You never know. You might meet a beautiful girl. You might not even care. I'm pretty sure Leonis would be fucking bisexual. I'm not even sure he knows what he is. He's like, I don't give a fuck. If it's beautiful, I love it. <laughs> if it can comply eyeliner and look fierce, I love it. No. Why are you just... You're, I feel so bad for you. You're teaching the poor child to talk while you're depressed. Because people are bullying you. I'm sorry, sweetie. They're just... You know what? People are bullying you because you're too beautiful. If girls are bullying you, it's because they're jealous how gorgeous you are. Because, like, have you seen your makeup skills and your fucking hair? <laughs> girls are jealous. And boys are just jealous because they just don't want to admit that they're gay and they're in the closet and they're just being assholes about it. And it's toxic masculinity is all it is. Hey, thanks, Ari. Yeah, I mean, you've been... You pretty much live here. Let's see. You got injured... But that's okay. You're probably playing. Seriously, still no idea where the hell you got your looks, but... She's over here. <laughs> Letting a child play with a screwdriver. Alright. We're chilling out hanging. Chatting with Patchy. Ooh, you know what would be cool? If we got another supernatural pack, I really just want to know what we're getting. I mean, we know our stuff pack is going to be our knitting pack, so that'll be the end of the year. So what's coming first in the next few months? Like, three packs in the next six months. I've been trying to figure this out all week. Like, does April count, or is it like May starts to count? You know what I mean? Like, I'm not even trying to hide it. No, everyone in this house, Patchy, is some kind of supernatural. We're not trying to hide shit. Just so you know. Like. Discovered. Really? Low brain power. 
Oh, well, maybe you shouldn't have performed brain power interactions on Patchy, dumbass. Oh, Soleil, I love you. There are just drinks floating all over that. Nope, somebody moved it, I guess. Not sure why you put on your winter wear to go pee downstairs, but that's okay. Oh, you're finally home. Hey. Welcome back. How was your time with Sammy? Did you have fun? Yeah, thanks for bringing our son home. Uh, appreciate it. You're cleaning up. Okay. <laughs> Every time he walks by me, I'm like, who the fuck? I always forget. I forget that he aged up. And I'm like, the hell? Um, you're supposed to not wear your outerwear inside. But you're all somehow <laughs> doing this. So Interesting. I love his room. Yeah. Anyway, let's check you guys out. So you're doing your project, but you're getting a little tired. So I'm going to let you go to sleep. You're also tired, so you can stop. You're, uh, I mean, we'll have people help you tomorrow. So why don't you guys go to bed? Everybody's wearing... No. Oh, right. I didn't assign your bed. Hold on. Assign right side of the bed to... Where the hell are you? You're Venus. Okay, I'm getting confused. Now you can go to sleep. That's your bed. We'll just pretend you took a shower before you went to bed because you're already tired. We'll just make you take one in the morning. I'll move it halfway down this way. We take one in the morning. I gotta cough. I'm not dying. It's fine. Why are you depressed? Oh. Stop. You have a nightlight. It's not supposed to be... Why don't you teleport up here? Because you also can't walk. Why don't you go up there and we'll put you to bed? Because gonna, we're going to make you tired. Stop crying, bratty little child. And go to sleep. Okay. Okay. Yep. Everybody should be going to bed. You should be going to bed. She's in bed. You should actually go to bed, though. No. What else do you need? You need to go grab something to eat. Babe, go get something to eat. You need to get something to eat. And you should actually go to sleep, too. Someone's getting abducted. And then I'm going to have you go to sleep. You are getting abducted. Oh, well, you were abducted. She's getting abducted. And you need to go to bed when you are done taking a bath. Why are you taking the longest bath in human history? Okay, you are, like, glitching up a storm or some shit. I don't know. But let's go up here and put you to bed. There's too many Sims in this house. We need to start killing some people. <laughs> I need to murder some people. Persepi freeze to death or some shit look if they die aside from like from whatever i'm not worried about it i'm just gonna let them go um you know what i'm saying not gonna keep them alive that's all i'm saying we just have so many of these fucking pumpkins Oh well, see, Aries' pumpkin is there. These two should go together because it's brother and sister, and then their pumpkins can kind of put hers there. We don't have a light for hers, and then you've got one in your inventory. That we'll just kind of shove over here. Yep, there's Aries. Hey, baby, I love you still. I still love him so fucking much. I mean... Okay, and now you're tired, so you should go to bed. I still love Aries to fucking death. Like, he is still one of the hottest fucking sims. There are just some sims that you love for no fucking reason, and Aries is one of those motherfucking sims. Like... It's the glasses. I literally think it's the glasses. Because it's 100% if he was in a Tome game, I'd be like, Yep, you. Won't you... Hey, hot stuff. Despite the fact that he had corpse skin, you know, because Suki. But he still, I just, I fucking loved him so much. And I still do. Although he's not as hot as a ghost. Um, but Leona's might come in a close. Where are you going? No, jackass. What are you doing? Go to sleep in your fucking bed. Sleep. Like, this is a sign to you. 
Why would you not go to sleep in your fucking bed when I told you to go to sleep? It's like, go to sleep. Oh, I'll go downstairs and sleep in the lounger. And why are you sleeping? Did she get abducted? She might have gotten abducted. For fuck's sake, none of these fuckers will stay asleep. Goddamn fucking aliens. All right. Well, you're actually fine because you're an alien. Well, you're... She just came back from being abducted. You better not be pregnant is all I have to say. Um, good. Free slots. Will, oh, well, I mean, it doesn't mean anything. Does not mean that anybody is not pregnant. So let's find our trash can. Because I'm assuming when it said clean out spoiled food, it's this. And you, your thing can go. Just put this on your desk. Because that's yours, and we can sell your homework. We don't need that shit. And is this a dance mat? Yeah, we can get rid of that. How do you have 90 roses? That's fucking a lot, girlfriend. All right, anyway, you're just shoveling snow, but can I have you while everyone else is asleep? Why the fuck is this bitch not asleep? Oh, she got pee. Oh, no, she's going to get abducted. For fuck's sake, Okay, let's just, um, fly here's a bat. Let's harvest everything. Let's leave our bees alone because they're enraged. I don't know why. Let's change. No, it is on classical, right? Well, let's just make sure because it should be, but everybody seems to, like, sell all the money fruit. Oh, it's probably only that one, right? Let's just super sell everything. That'll be easier. Evolve. Can't evolve that one. Um, and I can't evolve any of these, right? Nothing else is glowing. All right, you're good to go. Okay, why don't you go take a nap? <sighs> Could you, like, take a nap, like, in bed with your husband? Like, let's just do a vampiric slumber. I don't know. She's freezing to death. Let's just cancel that so she doesn't die. <laughs> oh, good lord. Everybody should be sleeping, but this asshole is like... Alright, I'm gonna teleport her when she gets home downstairs. <sighs> Alright. Teleport here. Oh, that's actually... Oh, yeah, it is. Tank it angry poop, I guess. And then we'll have you go back to sleep. I couldn't. I thought I couldn't click on the toilet. I was like, oh, maybe that's just a decorative one. That was fast. All right, now let's super speed. I was like, are you gonna wash your hands? Because I'm gonna cancel this if you try to run upstairs. Okay, now you need to go to sleep, and now everybody's asleep at 6 a.m. Yay! Ready? Yay! We got triple speed for like once! Oh, never mind. For all of five minutes because... Oh. Oh, honey, I'm sorry. All right, well, you should actually go take a shower. Your hygiene was lower. So, yeah, I'm going to have you take a shower and then you can go eat. I don't know why I take a shower and then I clicked it twice and I meant go roller skate. I know you're embarrassed. Shit happens, though. You know, it's okay. It's all right, girl. Nobody knows. Uh, why is your hygiene going up? Why does that... Hygiene. Take a fucking shower. And yet her hygiene was going up on its own, but even though it shows it's going down and it was getting... It was already in the... That is fucking bizarre. I don't know what the hell is going on. This is weird. Alright, then you can go eat. How are you doing? What do you need? Oh, you need to pee. Okay, well, no, 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 no. Why don't you just come here and use this one? I know, but that's why I'm telling you to use this one, sweetie. Because it's right fucking here instead of walking as far as you goddamn can. So why don't you go use that one instead of like, let me walk all the way fucking upstairs on it. I know that one's a nicer toilet, but like, he's still depressed. 
He's still depressed about school. Mm, poor little Wheel. <laughs> it haunts me. <laughs> it hurts me so much that he's so sad. Look at him. How could you bully this? I would only bully him because I just love him so much. Oh, you're being a pain in my ass. Oh, you don't know how to walk downstairs, do you? Okay, pause. I saw someone suggest this. And it seems like a brilliant idea. Where could we possibly put it? Let's go here. Mini fridges in the children's room! Instead of just throwing a plate out for them. Okay, let's, um... Let's find... Let's go here. Let's get a mini fridge. Get this little green one. Put you in this corner. Yeah, now they can just get food. But it's funny, because I've never knew that a toddler could, like, open this. But I guess... Open. Oh, oh, he can walk downstairs. Okay, never mind. Well, he's fine. He doesn't need to. Oh, he, he just teleported his damn self. All right, well, um, go get food. Okay, you're going to go get food. You're going to get that piece of pie. Okay, that's fine. You're getting food. You're hungry, but I don't think you can go downstairs. So why don't you open... And what's this? Uh, why don't you... Oh, I, you can't. So the that's useless. Oh. I mean, I guess it's just easier because you can, like, take this out and then be like, grab a serving, I guess. But I guess I could just also leave this on the floor in the room. So that was kind of pointless, I guess. I thought it was a great idea because I always leave something on the counter for them. But if they can't go downstairs, I teleport them and someone's like, oh, they put like a... You know, a um, mini fridge, but the kids can't, the toddlers can't grab a serving out of the mini fridge, so I don't know what good that does. Uh, let's grab a serving. Because you can't, uh, I'll just leave that up here for you, it's fine. Girl, what the fuck are you doing? Get up and go to school. No, we're not answering the phone, stop. Um, you're gonna have to go to school. You're at school, wait, you're at school. Did we join an after-school activity with you? Film and yearbook. Yes, we did. Okay. And I think we have to tell them to go. You're going to school, right? Good. She's going to school. She's going to be late. You are... Are you eating? What the fuck, kid? Grab a serving. Why are you not eating, you asshole? God, what a... I hate these toddlers. I fucking hate the toddlers so much. Wait, that's regular fruit salad, right? Okay. He's hungry. Well, it's because he's a fucking asshole. He was coming down here to get food, and then, like, somebody... I guess somebody took it. Stop that. I don't want to deal with you. Are you going to school or fucking what? Girl, how fucking long does it take you to go to school? Slowest goddamn child in existence. God. Well, I mean, I just want to... Like, do yoga. I mean, she is the hippie one. She's going to get her wellness skill up and she's going real fast, is all I'm saying. Like, Leonis was caught using his phone. Retake the test with no phone. <laughs> I don't really think you should be calling someone's nephew, even though he's older than him, to tell him off. Did you just stop this fucking child from eating? No, finish eating, you son of a bitch. God, I hate the toddlers. Clean up. And then let's, uh, more choices, toddler care, change diaper. What are you doing? I have the gig. No, we're not doing that. She should get a job, but... I mean, I don't think we have, like, a... Well, I mean, we do have a... Well, I mean, it's not going to help her. She needs to get her baking skill up, and we're almost there. Yeah, no, that's nice. Go away. Um, you know what I mean? 
Because she has to get to level 8 cooking or baking. And she's almost to level 8 baking. So we could get her a job, like, in the culinary career or whatever. But she's almost, like, yeah. We don't really need the money. It would just be to get her out of our hair for a while. Stop making me think about you. I'm busy. Oh, Sammy, you're so fucking cute. Would you fucking eat that? I know you wanted to go chat with your grandfather. Grandfather! Oh. Eat plasma fruit. What is this? That's fucking cute. Um. So let's have you eat that. Let's have you eat another one. He is obsessed. Like, with fucking cleaning. I mean, that does not go with any of our decor in this house. I mean, it doesn't match any of the fucking rooms up here. Doesn't match anything in anyone's room. I mean, we could technically put it in the bathroom, but it's like a coffee poster. So it would look a little weird in our bathroom. But, like, I mean, it matches. So, sure, I guess. Um... He's just all fucking over the place. Suki, will you fucking figure some shit out? Why don't you resume that figure painting? You're driving me crazy. He's like, I'm over here, I'm over here, I'm over here, I'm over here. Like, do something. Fucking make yourself useful. And where the hell is my toddler going? He's gonna go play. Alright, that's fun. Please don't freeze to death. Kinda need both of you assholes alive. Why don't you... Toddler care, give him a bath. Because he's, he's like, this kid stinks. Yeah, he stinks. Could you take care of him, maybe? You're going to go play outside, but I'm going to put you in your cold weather, because otherwise you're going to... You won't actually freeze, because toddlers can't freeze to death, so... But, you know, might make you miserable. Why are you depressed? Needs amusement. Did you not give this one a bath? Oh my god, you're such an asshole. Give kid a bath. Alright, let me go downstairs and check on the other one. Is Patchy going to come give you a bath? Because I'm fine with that, as long as someone gives you a motherfucking bath. Like, I told your father to change your diaper, and he didn't do it. And then I told him to give you a bath, and he didn't do it. And, like, I get he's got two toddlers to deal with, but, like... Are you going to ask Patchy for a bath? Because, like, that's cool. Oh, good lord. Good fucking lord. This toddler is never getting a bath. Suki, where did that go? Why do you have... Wow, you got a lot of these in here. Could someone give this toddler a bath? Suki, will you give him a bath? Oh, dear God, my fucking vampires are killing me. Can you... Okay, can you ask him for a bath? Help. Bath. Nobody else will give this kid... Hi, Suki. You've heard stellar things about you. Like, Joff, your interstellar opportunity. An astronaut. Morgan, how are you an astronaut? I'm not gonna... I don't wanna know. No? Nobody? Alright, what are you doing? You're showing needs... Fl okay. I'm gonna have you come and give him a bath then. Will you come bathe your great-grandchild? This is really awkward. It really is his great-grandson, isn't it? I mean... Oh, that's Suki. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I mean, this is our family tree. <laughs> We've literally gotten through to... We're on the Scorpio. We have one, two, three... We have four left... But our family tree only goes four deep <laughs> instead of like eight. Yeah, we're on the eighth, right? Because they they technically don't count. Four, five, six. Yeah, eighth. But they only go so far because they, you know what I mean? Like, um, where's my page down? I kind of hate. The only thing I kind of dislike about this new computer is the fact that there's no page up, page down buttons. I have to turn my num lock off. And then I try to use my numbers, and then I forget that the num lock... <laughs> I don't like that. 
He's like, hey, would you like a bath, maybe? Because you stink and everybody keeps complaining. Good job. All right. And you need to earn gold on three dates with your spouse. So we do need to get you and Soleil. You need to launch or upgrade a rocket five times. Um, I wanted to see. Oh, I want to actually see. Hold on. Ten logic skill. Fix or upgrade five objects. I don't know where his logic skill is. He's only a level six. It's going to take him forever to get there. We don't really focus on him. Oh, for fuck's sake. No, you asshole. Fuck you, Persepi. Fuck you. I have been trying to give this goddamn fucking toddler a fucking bath for like an hour. And she's like, get the fuck out. Like... Get out, I'm trying to pee here. There's 5,000 bathrooms. Fucking go somewhere else. You are such a fucking bitch. You know what? That is why you're gonna... Like, I swear to God, I think I want to have you choke on a scone right now. I don't even care. Your daughter doesn't need to learn mermaid shit from you. I'm gonna kill you. Like, go fucking bake me something so that I don't have to deal with you soon because, like, now you're made me mad. Kill her ass. What are these? Make those. Oh, don't cook anything. And then let's have you bake some more shit. I'm gonna have you bake a ton of shit so you can get to level 8 and I can off you. Fudge bars. Everyone in this house is gonna be so fucking fat. So all she does is bake. Okay. Thank you. Finally. And where are you? You're playing with... Nobody. You're not doing anything. Alright, what are you doing? Can you go resume your project? Wait. Talk to... Talk and make funny... Oh, he's coming to talk to you. Oh, that's adorable. Never mind. He's walking away. Oh, you're gonna go. What are you doing? Morning. He's remembering all the good times he had with his friend that passed away. Who? He's still getting bull- He's still sad about bullying. Okay, why don't you go grab something to eat? Um. Uh-huh. And then go to work. Oh, good lord. Okay, well, she's gonna go. Doesn't she have to go to her after-school activity? Oh, no, she doesn't- Oh, she's Tuesdays off from her after-school activity. She's only got Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Hers is Monday, Tuesday, Thursday. And his is mon oh, every day. Damn, boy. All right, you're going to have to go to your after-school activity instead of eating. I'm sorry. So you're going to have to leave that there. You're going to have to go to your after-school activity. Well, I mean, you should have fun and get some social skill. Yay, look at that. We'll keep those. <laughs> Um, I guess it's off to work. Oh, I can't do that. <laughs> he acquired the acting skill. Perfect. Nice. Required, acquired the media production, photography. Jeez, he acquired a lot of fucking skills just by showing up. New. I wanted to open this. Uh, let's see. What do we have in here? Fruit tarts. We got a lot of fucking bread. We need real food. We don't have a lot of real food. We got a lot of uh, exotic fruit pie. Okay, let's just get rid of the fruit pies and stuff like that. What's this? Spinach and onion quiche is fine. Um, Let's get rid of the fruit tarts. We need real food in here. I mean, bread, I guess, is okay. How many fucking things of bread do we have? We have bread. We have cheese bread. And we have banana bread. Okay, let's get rid of that. I'm just selling them because I just need her to make them and like whatever. And where is she going? Okie dokie. Fudge bars made you horny. Okay, great. Good job. All right. So, um, I'm sure it was Sammy, but at any rate, what are you doing? You're out here playing with your cousin? Yes, I think your cousins. <laughs> Well, no, well, your cousin cousins, because their cousins 
And that's your second cousin I got. I don't fucking know. Anyway. Whatever. So... Castor is a shining beacon of positivity for the community. Passing by other sims will elicit friendly waves and cheerful smiles as everyone's day is brightened by his presence. Friends will be more forgiving if he commits any social miscues, and they won't be quick to judge him. Finally, Castor has earned the credibility to host his very own charity benefit parties, gather other do-gooders together for a fun time while contributing towards excellent causes. Children don't receive their full range of benefits based on their reputation until they become teenagers. Wow. What kind of reputation does Suki have? He's got a pristine reputation too. And he's a B-lister. Oh, we've got fame points. What kind of what can we do with this? Established name. People are starting to recognize his name when he sells, publishes, or licenses something that took skill to create. He'll earn more money. Hmm. Giving back. Suki's good reputation has helped him establish a foothold in the public eye as a charitable and kind celebrity. Having built his fame upon bedrock of positivity, he'll not gain reputation faster. Well, I don't think he'd want that. <laughs> Forgot that he had that. No touching. Um, corporate partnership. Well, he doesn't do the video station or the music station. Social prowess deal with fellow celebrities. I mean, I guess he could get networking, though. He doesn't leave the house, though. Quick phone call can push news stories that'll put boost into fame and change reputation. I mean, I guess... We'll do that. I, get, I don't want to do that one. Let's just do those two for now. I don't think it really matters. I'm not trying to go down I'm fame things with him, on. but... <laughs> it is funny. Who's like Jeff now? She's got a good reputation. Does anybody have a bad reputation in this house? I mean, like, no, they shouldn't. He's already, like, a one-star celebrity. That's funny. He's actually, like, a relatively well-rounded, adorable person. What's this for? Happy days! And I'm like, actually, I love this. Like, he got... Quite a few skills just from going media production, photography, and acting. Has she gotten any skills? I mean, it might have helped some of her other skills. I'm not really sure which one she went into. Oh, she's in the yoga club, which... Does it say... It doesn't... Oh, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is what I wanted to do. Um, homework, health motives, wellness skill, body muscle, fat, and the motor skill. I mean, so she'll get motor skill. Um, but she hasn't popped up anything. Maybe doesn't. It's Ari. Do you want to hang out tonight? Uh, whoops. I didn't answer that fast enough. But also, we were way over time. So anyway, I'm going to wrap this part up here and we'll just continue. Now that we have all of our toddlers and everything in the house, um, our next birthday is not for a while. We don't have to worry. The twins. Oh, good. They're both there now. Um... So we got a ways to go before anybody ages up. And let's see. Uh, Prosepi does not age up into an adult until in the summer. We have about two weeks for her. So maybe when she's an adult, after that birthday, we have Harvest Fest. Maybe that's when we'll... That'll be her death day. Even though she's not going to be an elder, we'll do it as when she's an adult. Because she'll have gotten level 8. Um, Venus will have become a teenager. So they could spend some time together. We'll take a couple days off here in the summer. Um, so they can like spend some time together teaching her mermaid things. And then she can... And Castor will think about when he's when at least i want she's got to spend some time with her child you know what i mean and she's spending time with her now she's feeling a little flirty which is weird what's she sad about my feelings so they're chatting which is they're sitting weirdly together but um but yeah i mean i caster's gonna be hard well i guess maybe wait until his kids are pushing teens Kind of like with Persepi, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, we'll figure it out. Or when I just get sick of him. Because, like, honestly, like, we need some room. We do need some room in the house and, like, whatever. But anyway, 
Uh, we'll figure it out, and I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.